building a relationship with the inner core of your creative flow. I don't care if you're a banker, if you're in the grocery business, if you're an artist on canvas, songwriter, actor, creativity is what we live off and it knows it and it wants attention. Unplug because we will always say yes to creativity, totally uncut because we all make mistakes. So turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. Stream thinking, learning how to trust what's in your present. Now to get there requires practice. Here's how I do it. One sheet of paper every day. 10 minutes, that's it. Write whatever is moving through your presence of right now with absolutely no judgment. Stream thinking sharpens your skills as a listener, as a communicator, and as an activator. Learning to trust what is right now. This is stream thinking. Today we're reading from December 24th, 2022. This is a subject that a lot of people aren't going to be able to relate with, but here's how I want you to be able to tune into it. Don't think of what I'm talking about as being something that you can't tap into. Think of it as maybe your business, because businesses across this country and around the world are all going through an evolution of change. And in those moments of change, a lot of people are losing their jobs and they're losing interest in investing in what is a very potential future. So when I talk about radio here, I don't want you to think radio. What I want you to do is I want you to think how your own business, your own career and steps have changed. And together as a working community, we can bring these sides together and continue to be a city, a state, a nation, a world. This is Stream Thinking. I spoke with a fellow broadcaster from years past. Our views of the once vibrant radio studios dimmed by the actuality of today's performances. Devakar said to me, I think we were part of the final class of what is looked upon as being real radio. Mark Thompson from Mark and Brian talked to me about how his audience was once captivated for three hours in Los Angeles. That is absolutely unheard of today. There are too many choices. Our attention spans are extremely thin. Conan O'Brien from Late Night Television has a channel and a podcast. No judgment here. Congratulations. I've always believed that real people deserve to have a platform. Now, does this mean that terrestrial radio is over? God, no. It's just harder for people to get into and stay in. It's the new NFL. Not for long. With so many options and opportunities, a broadcaster's lifelong investment is worth what? Dot, dot, dot. Don't think of radio. Think of your own personal business, your own investment in the career that you have been chasing, leading, trying to replenish. Not for long is happening in every business. I see so much career hopping right now because people are seeking something other than what they had. And you try to get them to talk about it. And it's almost like talking to a U.S. soldier who says, no, I was just doing my job. And now I'm moving in this direction. And as those directions change, how does the weather system inside the heart change you? And how are you dealing personally with those changes? If you don't think that I don't see it in your eyes, you're crazy. My essential job is I am right there in the center of a grocery store. I I took on a grocery store job. Yeah, middle-aged crisis? I don't know. I just wanted to be with people. I love people. Being on terrestrial radio, I imagined there were people there. Being with people is what gives me energy. I'm charged up. I hear the stories. I asked God one day, and not to get religious on you, I said, I want to be involved in the communities that you create. Basically meaning, can you please get me deeper into the church? Because being a middle-aged man with long hair, ah, it ain't working. They, they, they just don't, I don't know. I don't know. Just get me involved in the community that you're building. And I was planted in a grocery store. Amazing what happens when you take the time to look beyond your personal investment in the business that you thought you were going to have for the rest of your life. If you haven't gone through a career change yet, but you're thinking about, I don't know if I should stay here. I don't know if I should. I I, I don't know. 
clear your heart. Don't open your heart. Your heart is already open. You're receiving everything. I mean everything. It's time to clear your heart and begin to listen to the actual calling. Follow the path. Replenish the fields. Believe in you before other people because those other people will always take advantage of you. I'm Errol, and that's Stream Thinking.